reason why many professional footballers can strike the ball with so much force is due to their elite fashion. So, is elite fascial connection from your foot to your glutes and abs why professional soccer players have such powerful shots? And it's how to get this by doing cow curls. No, absolutely not. That's completely hogwash. It is wrong. There are two reasons why professional players have stronger shots than you. And number one reason, they have better technique. They are more efficient with their technique than you are, probably because they practice more. And number two, they are stronger and more powerful than you are. And how did they get this way? Traditional strength and conditioning. So first off, let's go over how to make our shot more efficient with better technique. First things first, when we shoot the ball, we wanna make sure we're connecting with the right part of our foot. It should be our laces right here, pretty much on where you tie the knot on your shoelace. If you're hitting it down here on your toe, it's not gonna be as strong. If you're hitting it more on the inside of your foot, it's not gonna be as powerful. Two, you need to make sure your ankle's locked. If it's loose, it's not gonna be as powerful. You need to make sure it's locked. When we strike the ball, we wanna make sure we're hitting it dead center. So if I'm striking the ball, I'm gonna strike it here, I'm gonna fall through from there. And this point right here is the number one thing people mess up when they shoot. Most people, when they're shooting, they shoot like this. They Notice how I stopped my foot? I went to shoot and I stopped. If I wanna shoot full power, I want to follow through, landing on my kicking foot, and even better than that, I'm going to keep running a little bit after. So, if I'm gonna shoot with power, it's gonna look something like this. Notice, I kept my momentum going forwards. So that way, I put the entire mass of my body behind the ball to make sure I'm putting as much force into my shot as possible. So, for number two, how do we get stronger and more powerful for shooting? Well, that's where your strength and power training comes in. You need to get stronger in the gym. And yes, in the gym, not doing towel curls. You need to have stronger quadriceps. You need to have strong glutes, adductors, and hamstrings. And you need to get more powerful with that. Because you need both the strength of being able to absorb the impact of your plant step and the strength to actually kick with your kicking leg, which the kicking leg is gonna use a lot of quadriceps and a lot of hip flexors. The stronger and more powerful you get by doing exercises like squats, like lunges, also something like a leg extension or a sissy squat will make those more powerful. Exercises that work your posterior chain, like deadlifts, Romanian deadlifts, glute ham raises, Nordic hamstring curls, that will build your posterior chain, which will allow you to absorb the impact of your plant step better and produce more force into the ground to propel yourself forward with your follow through. So remember that fascia training will not make you a better soccer player. It will not make you shoot the ball harder. The reason when Erling Holland hits the ball, it stays hit and it's hit as hard as he is, is because his technique is excellent and he's strong as fuck. All right, guys, that's it. I'll talk to you guys next time.